Hey you guys, doing a self a toll boss. I've got my buddies Baldwin and Alpha Prodigy actually on the mic with me, so I'm hoping to do some videos with them and be able to kind of um, incorporate our group talk into uh, the videos for Dolly Games also now. And uh, so I was just told that I should be going to L3. Uh, one of the, the the tricks for these guys is that the sylphs do, uh, go away on the on the level that the boss is going to spawn on. Whereabouts are you guys? You're kind of in the in middle, the right? Yep. Yeah. Okay. So we're just going to hang out somewhere in the middle here. So what were all those things we were going to talk about, you guys? <laughs> we had an idea, and now I'm I'm the one forgetting it. Formation, um, synchronizing attacks. Yeah, lag. so formation, I'm, <laughs> I'm in front. Lag I think for most... <laughs> Uh, I think for the formation, I'm the one who just hangs out in the front. Uh, I think that's easier. Are we going to put Ball up there with you or no? No. <laughs> I think usually for it, it's nice to have a second uh, tank, but in this case, it's one of those things where uh, Ball will have to heal too much. It's nice for right. like Spire and stuff, but in this case, I think it's, it's not as effective. Um, right. Okay, so if we see that big green bug, so of the bosses, the wind is absolutely the worst. It's not just an elemental thing, it's definitely just, it hits the hardest. So if we get that boss, Gwyn has to stay with Herc, but I think uh, the rest of us should switch to Dark, because then we can heal ourselves too. If it's the green bug thing, but regardless. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Because right now I have Cerberus on, so that way it, it uh, increases our damage. Yep. But the softest bosses, I think, are the the water and... Um, which was the other one you were saying, Ball? The mage one. I can't remember. I think it's fire. Fire. Oh, so it's actually physical attack. So it's not magey. She looks kind of magey. I know what you're talking about now. <laughs> it does no damage. Yeah, hopefully it's that one. Yeah, and then there's one warmer that we're missing. Water, the water guy, he's like a he's like a horse with a with a dude. Yep. <laughs> a horse with a dude. That's a really technical term. What's the other one? I faced all of them by now. The electro one. I'm forgetting what it is, but I know there is one. I think it's like some sort of Majorly, dude. So go ahead and set y'all's uh, stuff to follow. Oh, yeah. So I can take y'all there. You want to explain why we follow? <laughs> oh, um, out of all the people we run with, I usually have the less lag. I don't know if it's um, just computer performance or, or what it is, but uh, usually when I'm running anything, I have less lag, so I usually take... Uh, I usually have them follow me. That way, if they are lagging a little bit behind, I'm by the by the time they actually catch up with the game's mechanics, we'll already be inside the the fight. So, yeah. That way, they're not trying to just trail behind, and we have to wait because if you go into the boss before, it's it's um like for example, if I go up there and Elia's still loading, she won't actually be in the fight. So. It's just a little, it's, you know, the little things that ain't, will increase the percentage that we do to the boss, so. Yeah, just being synchronized, I think, helps. Like, just getting in at the same time. If you have a weaker player who's lagging a lot, and then leaving them behind is maybe not a huge deal. That sounds really <laughs> terrible, but, um, but it's true. Um, but this worked the last time we did it, except for one time when you got so far ahead of me that I, I had to cancel the follow to press the button. Yeah. Well, hopefully it's not like that anymore, because you're not dual boxing. Yeah. yeah. Actually, even with a recording lag, it's not looking too terrible. All right, he is down. L3. He's down. I'm oh. already at him right now. Yep, go. Oh, I couldn't right. even see him on the map, because I, I couldn't reopen the map. Okay, I got Damnation going. You guys can go ahead and sylph. Okay. I brought Damnation too, but I figured you would probably get it, or you were Supreme. Oh, it's the fire one. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, that means I'm not going to do that much. Uh, you should do fine. Because you, uh, 
you get a buff right before they spawn, if people didn't notice, by the way, that um, yeah. actually reduces the, or increases the damage you do to all elements. So even if you're using a fire against fire, you still do pretty good damage. Right. What buff are you talking about? Why don't I get to see all these? You notice this stuff. It's up in the buff window. You'll you'll see it. It's it it's yeah. It's really nice. Immune to stun. No 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 not not on this person. When we're out. Oh okay. Before we go into the boss, it will show a buff that says your resistances are increased when Anger. attacking the Silphatol boss. And gotcha. resist reduction is increased. Right. I feel like I've heard somebody mention this to me, and I didn't pay attention. <laughs> Would it be the first time you didn't pay I attention to us? That's probably right. <laughs> I'm the mean one. It's true. Okay, the problem I have about using Herc, which I have yet to figure out a rotation where this doesn't happen, is I don't have him set for PvP skills. And so I don't have a basic attack, and I just end up failing really bad. I forgot about this. So I'm going to switch to... I'm going to switch to Gaia, because I just find it too frustrating to use Herc for PvE. Why am I not following you? Oh, it's because Jordan isn't moving. Yeah, I was lagging. Oh, <laughs> That's nice. how bad it was. I'm fine. I'm up here. I don't have block I didn't block the players. Oh, gotcha. I didn't, yeah, I didn't block them. Uh, one second. Got it. You got it? Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. All right. So one nice thing about getting double hits, and there's a million different ways to get double hits, but the one I'm using right now is just, uh, I'm just hitting a Chaos Rune, you can use any rune, and then immediately, uh, use, uh, hit Awaken, and, uh, and then your, your skills should be open to, to blink and get your double hits. I love it. it means I don't have to use the skill, because, uh, Alpha already has already has the the damnation or maybe you didn't get the damnation never mind i did he did it only lasts like 3 turns wait what level is you what level is your damnation uh 3 no the level 3 lasts like like 5 turns doesn't it well i think there's a isn't there a, a talent for it i haven't leveled up that talent yet no, the, the talents is only for um, damage. damage dealt and cooldown. Wow, I didn't really think about that. <laughs> Took a moment. Yeah, I, I did it. I always do it before we go into the fight. Mm, I'll, check. I'll double check. Yeah, see, I'll, level I'll, 3. Because the Q Last 5 turns. Yeah, 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 so the QTE should put five turns. So how did we lose it so quickly? You know what it probably is? It's probably my bite. The bite probably gets rid of it because yeah. it's a damage increase. Oh, okay, so you kind of have to time that a little bit. Yeah, I won't bite then. Not right off the bat. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds funny. That's Sorry. Just, it's not called bite. It's called, uh, it's in, infernal inflammation. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. So it's all light. <laughs> well, I mean, this only does it by 10%. The bite does it by third. Well, no, what is the bite? 10%. Oh, okay, never mind then. Yeah. Anybody catch out how, how well before. we're doing? Yeah, we're, we're in first. Nice. We're like a percent ahead. We're at like 3%. They're at like 2 Oh, that's pretty <clears throat> big for for the first half of a boss. First half of one bar, anyway. I don't know. I mean, if I'm going to keep Damnation on, I don't know. It might be better for me to get Aegis just because I can double hit up better. Don't you think? Yeah. Are you, How are your skills set on Aegis, though? Um, Basically. Oh, yeah, not Aegis. Oh, I was I, thinking of... I wasn't thinking of Aegis. I mean, her... Or, uh, Cerberus? Yeah, I was thinking of Cerberus, and you were saying... It, it's... A, yeah. No, I'm terrible. Yeah, I think I have, Cerberus is the bite you can use, like, every other turn. Yeah. I have um, Dragon Blast, which is one of the free ones you get when you first get it. The Delphic, the Bite, the Firestorm, which is the AoE, and then Vulcan's Blessing, which is increased damage by uh, 20%. So I don't have anything to really double hit with, which is why I was thinking Aegis might be better. Yeah. 
Then I would go. What do you yeah, think? Yeah, I would go with Aegis. If you're more comfortable with Aegis too, then it's probably a better choice. Well, I can get the double hits off a little bit better too. Yeah. We'll see. I'll, I'll switch to it right now, and we'll see if it increases a little bit. So about 8.5 million points. And I think Cosmo posted it. It was something like 60 points to one one gold or six. It was 60, 6 or 60. I forget which one. I don't know. I guess I might as well pop a pot or something, right? Maybe I should. You close by? Um, there you are. Yeah, I'm there. I'm, I'm within range. Right. Yep. I like that there's actually like new bosses too for this. Mm. Oh yeah, it's not the same thing. No, I just feel like they recycle bosses so much. It's not a it's, it gets, yeah, exactly. I figured that's what it would be. I think I saw previews, but I just I somehow assumed that that's just I've been conditioned by this game to think that oh, it's just gonna be the same like eight bosses over and over again, like three varieties of dragons. <laughs> I don't know if Supreme uses double hits, but he seems to be doing pretty well. Yeah. Supreme's the only one not on the call, might I, might I add. But he's not usually grouped with us, but um, he's a very strong strong mage, so it's nice to have him here with us. Just in case there's any confusion, um, I'm Alpha. I'm the one that's talking. and then <laughs> We should probably have done, done yeah. inter introductions. Baldwin is the, the other guy talking. The one with the deeper voice. <laughs> no. No, not at no. all. <laughs> uh, I was. Who was I just talking to? I think I was talking to like Cyprian or something the other day, and I was like, "No, Baldwin and I basically sound like Yankees," <laughs> and I was like, "The same Yankee." Even though you're you're not from New York like I am, but but definitely just sound like Yanks. It's the whereas, West Coast accent. Whereas, uh, yeah, west, east, I don't know, but whatever it is, we just, our voices are not as pretty. Jordan's, I'm like, oh, he, Jordan has this nice, like, low voice for the <laughs> recording that sounds all good, and I was like, uh, I'm a little jealous. <laughs> it's that Hispanic I know, just because, <laughs> yeah, no, and just to clarify, because I get this so much, I am a woman, just because I'm <laughs> jealous of Jordan's nice recording voice does not mean, I keep on calling him Jordan, so everybody's going to know your real name, That's or fine. at least real first name. That's okay. <laughs> was... Jordan's a pretty name. <laughs> <laughs> pretty name for a pretty man. I'm very pretty. Are you hitting on my husband? <laughs> <laughs> okay. I forgot that Bwin's territorial. <sighs> And they're hubbies, by the might I add, but I don't think you're in game. Are in do game. Anything. In game. Let's just make sure we add that. In game. I am married with a wife and a daughter. Okay. And children. <laughs> Maybe I'm I love I love Baldwin, but he, yeah, he's single. There you go. <laughs> That does not mean that I'm <laughs> I'm putting out a, an advertisement to find when a girlfriend right. <laughs> through through Wartoon. <laughs> Maybe we should hook him up with somebody. I don't know who though. What? Uh... I'm, trying, I'm trying to go down the list. Well, ladies. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like toothpicks? <laughs> <laughs> Do you like bean poles? Because he is of a tall, skinny stature. <laughs> Man, this boss is kind of dying slow today, isn't it? Yeah, I was expecting things to go a little bit more quickly. I think everybody after World Boss and doing so much of God's Ascent is just like, I'm gonna peace out. I'm I'm pretty sure that's what happened. Today was the, uh, you know tonight was the last night of God's Ascent, and everybody is I think exhausted from the monotony that is God's Ascent. Maybe the the single most boring War Tune event. I spent most of it just a on AFK mode. Um, Alpha, you didn't even do anything on it, did you? Yeah, did damnation. No. No, I don't. Mean... <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh. 
<laughs> we, su- we switch topics. Sorry, I was, I'm kind of paying attention to chat and to you guys, so just a little bit mixes in. Um, I did five of the free ones, and then I just did a few before this happened. But I'm not really worried about it since I have three fine silks now. I'm just like, yeah, I mean, what's the point of spending money on it? There's not really a point. I mean, you get gold and you get sands, and if you get the first hit, you get shards. But yeah. it's it's not enough to where I'm like, oh, I should spend you know five bucks and revive so many times. When- I was having such a hard time getting people to take the first hits. I'm so glad that Avarice um, got some of them, but it took. It, like, I had to beg people to take the first kills. It was amazing. Well, if I was on, I because... would gladly take it. Man. <laughs> Grimoth took, like, the first ten. But everything after that was pretty open. <clears throat> I like this whole, like, lazy thing. Where I just follow. <laughs> <laughs> Do you see that buff on up there now? Before we go back into the fight? Looks like a shield with, like... Is this God's Thank blessing? Oh, wait, which side? Oh, never mind. Never mind. It'll be top left. I'll get it. It'll be top By the end of the video. <laughs> By the end of the video. Is it up with, like, where... Where your, um... Your buffs are. Your buffs are and that type of stuff? Yeah, it's right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was looking there. I didn't see any icons that I didn't recognize, It's though. a shield that looks like it has blue and red meteors attacking it. Right. These are not things I notice. I got asked about the the little buff. I get asked about it all the time. Is the the one for um the Sylph one? God, what's it called? Oh, wait. Sylph Overlord. Oh, that because, one. Because you know, like only like three people on the server even like get a little book up there that you know gives them the buff, and so a lot of people didn't recognize it. But I always forget about that stuff. It gives you a crap ton of BR. That's yeah, it's like a shit. it's like a big mount is basically the equivalent. It's yeah. a plus. It's the equivalent of a plus fifty mount, just not actually a mount. That's the buff you get if you make sure you're up all the way through midnight server time. <laughs> Pretty yeah. much. I think Grim can only steal it from me if he really tries. Like, I, it, it's very difficult for his team to lose to me. Now. Once upon a time, it was like much more either like favoring him or fifty-fifty. Yeah. yeah. Am I really the only one that has fire resist? Probably. I'm Probably. like I'm like taking nothing from these guys, and you guys are taking like not not a lot, but like you know sometimes it gets down to a quarter that you guys take from him or something. I'm like, man. Eh. Shock has fire resistance on. I don't. I don't keep any fire. That's why I was saying when we were talking about like the the teams for. Uh, crossover GB. I was like, oh, Midori's got a pawn because <laughs> her main sylph is, is a fire one. Yeah. Oh, why did I just use thunder? Because it's you're because... intelligent. No. <sighs> you're so mean to me. Um. No, we were talking about God's Ascent and all of a sudden I was like, oh, I'm going into God's Ascent, which is what I, you know, I would lead with thunder or something. So That's the only reason why that happened. What's good crit ball? Our... What's going on? I got a good crit off. He got like almost, got like almost five crit off. I just had a really fantastic lag spike. It lagged the audio, it lagged my game. I don't know, I feel like we could probably get more with me going back to Serb. Or maybe even Herc. I mean, try whatever you want. I mean, I don't think it's going to make a huge difference as far as like how far ahead we're going to get. I was going to say, ouch, that, that's mean. <laughs> I don't make a huge difference. Uh-huh. Yeah, the the main thing is working yourselves together. Like our group could be way better. Uh, mm-hmm. If to be honest, to optimize this group, if I had Pan, <laughs> would optimize this. Not group. Pan. Let's be honest with yeah, ourselves. It has to be a Medusa. One, but yes, but nobody has committed to 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 getting a win self other than myself in our group. I don't want to try and convince Shock because she's already kind of having to switch gears and build a Herc. Yeah. So we got 10 from that one. I'm going to see if we can switch into Herc would increase it a little bit. Yeah, let's look at our numbers. Just try a bunch of different Sylphs. I tried earlier. Oh, that was actually a good round. That was 10 mil. 
We I had like an eight mil I... one before. Maybe I should lag more often. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. And since I have fire resist, it's gonna help, like as far as survivability. You got? Do you, I mean you don't need really survivability here. You should be fine here. No, I mean like look at that. You see? Like hit him for a little bit, but he has a heal, so. Buna is the one that has to struggle for DPS the most here. I don't like. I have more DPS skills on my Herc than I do. Than he does, so I don't know how he manages to keep a consistent flow of DPS on that thing. Very carefully. <laughs> <laughs> if you're if you're wondering what she's talking about, I have the heal on my Hercules. Um, for night class wars, it's amazing. For everything else, it is absolutely garbage. <laughs> and so, doing this, you lose a turn normally using the heal just because no other skill is up to keep your double hits going. But if you can time it right, you can get Jupiter's Wrath off after each skill to at least keep somewhat of a DPS rotation going. Oh, you get Jupiter's Wrath off after every single skill? Mm-hmm. I feel like it's too heal slow. Rune, juggling Chaos Rune. Mm-mm. I've, like, I've tried to get close on that. I never... I always have to have two turns between the Jupiter's Wrath. So I gotta That's record just... how to do it for you. <laughs> Yeah, why don't you? <laughs> it it takes a lot of concentration, but if you can do it, so it took a little less that one. We did less. Yeah, by a mil. You can try Serb. Yeah, I'm going back to Serb and seeing how that works. Well, there's at least six parties here, so there should be a last hit reward at least. How many people does it take? Forty? I think it's forty or something like that. I don't know. I know if you don't have at least five parties, there's no chance. <laughs> <laughs> Just because we've had four, and it's like, nope, sorry. No bueno. Oh, dear God. Just go. Sorry. What'd you do? Oh, you did Damnation. No, I, I ruined, and then I just blanked out and didn't sylph soon, soon enough, so I had to use a skill in order to get into my double hits. Which is double why hits are. On the bar. Yeah. Double hits are completely worth it. They do work in here, even in a group setting. I feel like for PvP, double hits are really a lot harder to pull off. Um, they're still important to make sure that you can... This is a really beautiful image on the screen that is now frozen. I wish you guys could see it, because it's like this beautiful, like, plumy fire thing that my screen is stuck on. Am I doing anything? Am I just auto auto attacking? Yeah, auto -attack. yeah fantastic. Usually, if you kind of just yeah. push through. Yeah, you can um, normally still cue the skills. Yeah, that time it was just super fail. Um, but actually, I find in here refreshing is not always the best no. alternative. Just like completely ditching your group is not actually the the solution. Okay, maybe I should go back to Aegis. <laughs> <laughs> have, have we have we made a, gotten a, a definitive answer on what your best self is? I think so. Watch, <laughs> I'm gonna we're gonna do another ten mil round. We're gonna do like, another okay. ten million round. Yeah, it might have just been a fluke. A huge part of it is just uh, crit quality. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'm doing I'm NH, NH, NH still. And then it's also <laughs> um, if you can get the double alt off. Yeah. Oh, maybe I should try to do that on video. It's I find the timing just really difficult, especially when I'm lagging. But if you... What Buen's talking about is getting two Delphics out. So right now I'm going to Delphic as soon as it's available to me. And hopefully within, you know, the 45 minute... Uh, 45 second cooldown for that. At the very, very end. It's usually the last strike before um, the boss kills everybody. You can get in another Delphic. But I think with the lag, I mean, the last time I tried to do this when I was super laggy, I ended up like 10, ten seconds short, and I was like, I, I did all that effort for nothing. On her behalf, though, like, even with, with lagging, it's still really hard to get down because if the boss attacks too soon, if he attacks 
like if you alt and then he attacks literally right afterwards, you're okay. not going to get the double attack alt off. But if you can get the double hit alt early and then like two of your people attack, then he does, then you can still get it. So it does take a little bit of luck to double hit it, but yeah. if you can do it, it's another 500k damage. <laughs> like I'm trying to do it here. Clicked it. Let's see if I can get the double hit for it. Will it go off? Yes, it does. See right here. There's my second alt. Yep. See, mine still had like eight seconds. I had five seconds. You're doing to go. your you're doing damnation first. Yeah, damnation. Oh, right, yeah. Right. If you so do damnation early, ahead. there's no way. Well, I mean yeah. there probably is a way, but it's much, much harder. You, did you see that we did ten mil that round? <laughs> <laughs> okay. No we didn't. Nine point nine. Oh Okay, well, round it up. I don't know what the rhyme or reason is. It might be just the 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 Gaia passive is enough. The, I mean, the thing with Gaia is just that the more damage you take, the more damage you deal. That's one of the passives on it. So, I'm not taking that much though, honestly. That's why I lead with this life steal is because usually at the beginning I don't get hit anyway, so I'm at full health. It doesn't really matter. But after that, I try and save uh, my second devour soul until. Till the end. Yeah, I feel like in order for me to get that that second Delphic, I'd have to give up my double hits. Because I would do the Delphic second move, but I would have to wait like a second or two to make sure I do it exactly the right time. Yeah. But I don't want to do that. <laughs> I don't know. I'm probably too indecisive for Wartoon. <laughs> You're not the one switching between sylphs. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> Maybe that's just our team. <laughs> Indecision. We try everything at least once. We should make make a make a three person guild and rename it that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And then someone double attacks, so I can get the alt. No. Wait, yours was already up? Oh my god, it's yeah. five seconds every single time. Unless her, unless her pushes her cool down. No, it's 45 seconds, isn't it? I think so. Yeah, either you're just gonna have to like not double hit once for you to yeah, be able to do it. Yeah, 45 seconds. <laughs> yeah, we but got not ten double hitting million. once, but what help? Exodus party. That's probably grim, right? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Grimith is our top knight. He's quite strong, and he runs with a couple archers, which... <laughs> Wait, not... I'm not top knight? <laughs> Fallen is not top knight by any stretch of the imagination. That was me. Obviously, I'm not top mage. <laughs> <laughs> what, was it, what was it during Crossover GP that, that your brother... Oh, that you? Wiz Dread? Yeah. <laughs> uh, we needed mediocre. your mediocre mage. <laughs> That's cruel, seeing as you have... I, a hefty amount of BR on him. I was like, okay, if, it, if you guys need a <laughs> mediocre mage, I'm just going to go back to watching my movie. <laughs> <laughs> go eat Cheetos. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Play peekaboo peek with my daughter. I don't know. She's probably pa past the peekaboo age, isn't she? Never mind. I wonder if she still laughs at it. <laughs> Have we figured out if if that MDEF reduction really helps with PvE? I'm pretty convinced that it doesn't. I've, oh, like, yeah. stopped using it. Not that you can give it up just because you need the skill. I'm just saying that... It's dumb! <laughs> <laughs> I can't get that second Delphic to that. There's no way. I've done it before, but... Oh, and I wish I could get it on tape, but... Too bad, so sad. I don't know if we're going to be able to get back in for our last hit. We might be able to. We should be okay. Um. Yeah, you're right. Uh, we'll cut it close. I feel yeah, like the yeah. turns feel a lot, a lot shorter. It's probably just a mental thing, but I feel like the turns go shorter when you're able to get the double it hits in. Right. Yep. Or am I it just? It seems like there's not enough, a lot of time between his attack and your attack. Yeah. One.
but we're pretty good about getting in and out and you know like I'm normally the first one up there if he's low and when we get back up I'm just gonna go in instantly to snap yeah, yeah, just go <laughs> I mean, I would be up there with you. I'm just waiting on Haley because she's following me. Because <laughs> I'm a slowpoke. No, it, I auto-follow you. Right now, I don't have to click anything after we get out. Yep, it just takes you a second to actually get up there with us. Yeah, I don't know if we're going to be able to get back in. Back in. Oopsie. Cutting it close. should be able to. It should be killing us here in like in 10, seconds. 10 seconds. Yeah. Just rush back. I think I can rush back myself. <laughs> yeah, just go. Me. Just go for it. <laughs> Uh-oh, that was not... <laughs> I feel like that was like Grim doing a Delphic or something. Just a huge chunk out. It's about to Delphic us right now. Oh, wait. Wait. Wait, what? What happened? Oh, I might double hit alt. Oh, cool. I might double hit alt. Oh, double hit alt. oh last Let's... hit on a deflect. 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 We got it. We oh my god, hope we got it. Yes. No. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Don't get me excited like that. That's me. I saw. I saw. I saw it say Alpha Prodigy, and I was like, yes. <laughs> you guys are so such teases. So eleven Vulcan yep. stoves. That's awesome. The fifty crystalloids, which I think is based just if you do enough of the boss, if you, then you get fifty. If you're first or second, you get fifty. No, I've if gotten third, third and gotten fifty, so that's not. Totally it. I think it's like a per by percentage of the boss you've done, you get the top prize is 50. <laughs> We're in disagreement about that that one. And then 10 Mystery Stones, I love that because I love... Derek says he got third and got 50. Nah. -huh. Uh -huh. And, um... The hell was that? That... That was... That, 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 that's, no, that's Ilya's... Uh, I was right, noise. <laughs> Who needs... All I heard was... Nah. <laughs> <laughs> Ten so crystals. Don't make me giggle. I'm trying to end this video. <laughs> Damn it. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> I see. I either have to have a blooper reel, or we're just gonna let this go. This is... This is pretty oh. much how... It, how every single call with us is. It ends up just being... People laughing at me. <laughs> Can you blame us for that one? Like, no. <laughs> I felt like you were trying to say nice, but ran out of breath, and you said no. Nah. <laughs> uh, I can't control it now. Oh, darn it. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Okay, okay. <laughs> Goose for bra. Oh, oh man! Grapefruits. <laughs> <laughs> Gather myself again. Grapefruits. <laughs> Did that not help? Okay, so fifty silver crystalloids. Those are towards uh, being able to synthesize a mount. That actually doesn't take very long. So I don't know what else you're going to be able to do with those. Um, I'm very curious about what'll happen so there. You can get soul crystals or kyanite. Oh. Or is it soul crystals or gold? One or the other. Oh, that's boring. If you want to show that, Elia, go to the Silk Exchange person right by the entrance to the Silk oh, Hotel. Gotcha. And there's a second tab you can click, and it's on there. Very nice. I'm glad everybody else figures this stuff out. A little bit of lag. Okay, Alice. Silk Exchange. And Silk Atoll. Sack of Gold. Soul Crystal Chest. And CK, CK Star. CK Star. I don't know <laughs> what that's supposed to be. Plus 20 mount, basically. Um, max attribute plus level... Uh, max attribute level plus 5, which I definitely want to be able to open up my mount more. So yeah, not too interesting after that mount. <laughs> I hope they put more stuff in there, but I won't hold my breath. Um, what else did we get? So... Um, Guardian Treasures 2, Chance for Gold, Daru, Mystery Rune Stone, Mount Hooves, or Soul Crystals. Obviously, number one would be Mount Hooves there, and after that, to me, I would like the Mystery Stones, and then Daru, no, no then Gold, then Daru, then 
My soul crystals are not very useful. But every single time I open those, I get gold. What'd you guys get? I got Daru. I got Daru. Get a little less than one refresh in, in the wild shop. But anyway, I think I lost Jor oh, we lost we lost Alpha. But uh, no, I'm here. I'm just recovering from my, that laugh. <laughs> Give me some time to recuperate. I got a bottle of water right here. <laughs> Control yourself. No. Please. Gather your thoughts. Okay. <laughs> well, anyway, thanks for joining me, you guys. Big thanks to Alpha and Buen for doing this. Hopefully we can, I don't know, become somewhat more professional for another video. I'm not sure it's going to happen just because I think we're total goofballs most of the time when we're on calls together. And that's perfectly okay. Um, but anyway, say so long. See you guys later. Bye. Have a good day, you guys. Take care.